Okay, dear students, in previous classes we have learned the rules. Okay, rules of transformation. Mm -hmm. But today I like to uh, teach you the fill in the gaps. Mm -hmm. And you have a common idea that fill in the gaps is just having the answer in the gaps. But it's not the fact. The fact is that we must know the rules which word will take place in which gaps. Yes. And this depends upon not only on tenses but also other structure of the grammar. Okay. And for example, number A is done for you. You will just look how I have filled it and then you will fill in the gaps and B noun passes. Okay. So first see here this is filling with clues in close test in number one question uh, we have this type of filling the gaps with clues and here we have 10 words those are apparent have bad of in about lie aware source cope okay yeah and we must have the sense of meaning also beside the sense of tense apparent that is it's very much vivid apparent is vivid have something which is present we say it have bad it's the ill side of anything of is a preposition in preposition about preposition and lie lie here lie means having something somewhere that is lie aware very much conscious. Aware means very much conscious. Source, it is types or kinds. Source. And cope is to adjust with some body or somewhere. So, notice here how I feel it in Bangladesh dash in the southern part of Asia. That is, here the word we are finding out the verb as it is subject. As it is subject. So, it will take here only verb. So, which is the verb here? Apparently, it's not verb, it's adjective, bad adjective. Like, it's verb. And it may be placed here. But, Bangladesh is subject singular and third person. So, in its simple present tense, we shall place here lie with S. Bangladesh lies in the southern part of Asia. And it's a common speech in, in case of common speech regular speech unusual usual speech we use simple present tense and in simple present tense if the subject is third person and singular number then the main verb takes the s is it clear okay now she is now dash in the grip of all dash of pollutions she is now dash in the grip is here is the main verb is here main verb so here where we have already gotten the verb then we can use here an adverb and from adjective we can change it in adverb with its suffix ly that is <laughs> she is now badly in the grip of all dash of pollutions all dash of pollutions what may be the answer of all dash of pollution? All types of, kinds of, sorts of. Here we have sorts. So, source. we place here sorts. Yes. All sorts of pollutions yes. like air pollution, soil pollution and water pollution. The dwellers of the urban areas are the dash sufferers. How type of sufferers? Are the dash sufferers. Here as it is R, so are the apparent sufferers, apparent, the answer will be apparent, not apparently, answer will be apparent. Why? Because sufferer is noun, sufferer is noun. So before noun in the gap, we can use adjective and apparent is adjective. Which is adjective? The part of the speech which expresses the quality of the noun. Here the noun sufferer is noun so apparent and adjective it can take place before sufferer so are the apparent sufferers 
That is, they are very much vivid sufferers, life sufferers. Okay, apparent sufferers of such pollution. The industrialization process where in Bangladesh. So here the preposition in is placed before a noun. Okay, we are having the contact with the noun with other word process. So here the process and noun Bangladesh is being contacted with in. This is preposition. What is preposition? In. Preposition is the word which relates a noun with other word of the sentence. Here Bangladesh is a noun. So we can relate it with process with the preposition in. Because as Bangladesh is the place. The industrialization process in Bangladesh over the past decades dash created. Here created this past participle. So very normally we can use here have for present perfect tense. Okay. Have created significant environmental problems. We know dash some of the most common types. We know how know we know awarely. Consciously. We know awarely some of the most common types. What types? Types of here will be of H number will be of environment pollutions and ways of dash with. Here the group word cope with is a group word. Cope with is a group word. When we see that here is the preposition with after with there is a pronoun. So we can say that cope with. So Ways of as it is of so cope is placing with ing. Copy. And, yes. Ways of coping with them. In this case, we need dash most. We need about most. Okay. Now you have already seen how I have filled in the gaps. Here the words have adjusted the gaps according to its meaning and also its grammatical structure okay now if you have noticed it i think you will be able successfully to fill in these gaps okay so solve it with me how you have already learned here i shall evaluate from this passage okay everybody get ready yes how okay. are the words are become. Become that is to turn into something. Become yes, means to turn into something. something. Okay. Engage. To become. Engage means to be with something or someone. Or someone. That is engage. Having employed. Or having included with something. And it is article you know. And, and indefinite article, it will be used before uh, vowel, okay, before vowel uh, pronunciation. Occur, it's a verb, occur, that is happen. Occur means to happen. Out, it's another preposition. A, another article, indefinite article, will be used before consonant uh, pronunciation. Those, it is pronoun. Conspiracy, it's a noun word. Conspiracy. Okay, that is having something odd against someone. That is conspiracy. For level, level actually, level is the uh, state of something or some word activities. Level. The it is also article. Uh, it is a definite article. And two, it's preposition. Okay. Now. You will fill in the gaps, I will help you and I will evaluate how you have learned it from the previous passage. Okay, next. Everybody, there is a verb, proverb regarding idleness. That idleness is the dash of the devil. Idleness is the conspiracy. That is, this is, is taking the word noun. Is is taking the object and object will take a noun and here we are finding out only one noun conspiracy so it will be placed here and you have done it correctly conspiracy good 
The proverb is that idleness is the conspiracy of the devil. Idleness brings destruction. Dash anyone for Mr. Iman. Okay. That is for for anyone. It is similar. Dash a destructive power because similar takes the word. Similar takes the word what? Refer same. Similar will take the word two. Two. Similar to. That is we make it compare with a preposition similar to. Thanks. It is similar to a destructive power because it can destroy everything. Dash who are idle. Dash who are idle. Which will be the word? Dash. Tell me, Tadha. Okay. Dash who are idle. Dash who are idle. Huh. Which will be the word? Those. Which will be the word? Those. Yes. Those. Yeah. 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 Your friend have your friends have helped you, but you have identified the word. Yeah, yeah. So thank you. Those. Those. Simon is help Talha. I will can never come dash successful. What? Can never come dash successful. What will be? Okay, Nifat, say. Come out. That is, as a result, we can see it as come out. Come out successful in life. Because idleness closes the gate of their prosperity. The gate of one's prosperity can be opened when one works hard. Dash idleness is known. What will be? Titi. And. And idleness. We have here two indefinite articles, A and N. But why we are using an? Nifat, say. Okay. Why we are using an instead of M A? Yes. Here is vowel pronunciation. Idle. So we are using here an. An idle is known as dash devil's workshop. Dash dash devil's workshop. Say. One. The the devil's is known as the devil's workshop. Because many bad and harmful things and thoughts dash in an idle brain. What? Stand up, please. Okay. Stand up and say. Please. Mm, okay. Say. Stand up. Uh, things and thoughts dash in an idle brain. What? What? So occur. Occur. Things and thoughts. These are these are the group words and these are plural and. It is constructed with N. Okay, so this is these are the in group subjects and these subjects are in plural. So we are use here only occur. Okay, we are using here only occur. No S or ES is taking place because it is plural subject. Okay, and this is the <coughs> regular happening. In case of regular happening, we can say occur in an idle brain. We should always try our dash best. Did you tell them, sir? We are. We should always try our dash best. Level best. Level best. Good. Very good. Level best. That is level best is the <coughs> word which is using before the word best because. It is expressing the status of best to remove the idle thinking from dash brain by dash itself. Okay. Remove. 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 Engage. <laughs> by engaging. Okay. You have identified the word. Thank you very much. Engage. But this word may be changed according to grammatical structure okay and say here by whenever you will use by that is preposition the word will be by engaging by engaging okay the last word will be engaging so you have successfully filled in the gaps and i think that you have already understood the previous one so you have become successful to Solve it successfully. So thank you very much. Well done.